Hi there guys, uh, I'm Manchester based personal trainer Elliot Hunt. Uh, what we've got for you today is the second of our 2013 home workout videos. Um, today's uh, workout is going to be all about uh, lower body, um, it's going to be hitting both sides of the legs, uh, and we're going to get some stability in there as well. Uh, the workout itself is going to have three parts. We're going to have a warm up, which obviously just do uh, once, and then right at the end, once you finish, there's a bit of a cool down. Uh, and then there's going to be two parts the um, conditioning set or the work set. Uh, and then the strength work as well, so the strength set. You're meant to do them as many times as you can, so if you manage to do each set twice the first time, try and do them three times or four times the second time just to progress. Uh, what we're going to do just to warm up initially is just start with some basic hamstring stretching. So all we need to do is we're going to try and keep our knees back, so we keep our legs locked out dead straight, and all we're trying to do is just touch the floor behind our heels and back up. So we're going to go for 10 on each side. Keeping your legs as straight as possible. Okay, right, and I'm going to go into what's called a split squat. So, all you're looking to do, if you're looking at it from the front, you just want about a foot. Foot's width between uh, both your feet, and all we're looking to do is just bend that front knee and touch that back knee down to the floor. So we're just touching down and driving back up. So we're going to go for 10 on each side. And we're going to switch over our legs. Okay, right, so what we're going to go into now is what's, uh, what we're going to call the cardio set. Um, so all we're looking to do is that if we get on into press up position, all you're looking to do is just on your toes, we're just going to hop in, stand bolt upright, jump back, 10 of these. Okay, right, so what we're going to do again, down at that press up position, what you're looking to do is going to bring one knee into your chest and put it back. So we're going to go for 20 of these. Again, keep your belly button sucked in, tense your abs as much as you can. Okay, well, we're going to stay in that press up position. If you can go straight from that one into this one, then great. If you need a quick second, then that's fine. You're looking to go into a press up position, and all you want to do is take one finger, touch behind that wrist, and put it back. So it's going there, there, there. And we're going to go for 30. So with this, 10 reps, 20 reps, 30 reps of each of the uh, different exercises. So we get one, four, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Get a nice steady pace. Go as fast as you're comfortable with. Okay. So then, what you need to do is just take dining chair, and all we're going to look to do is just place one leg up to the first of our strength exercises, and all we're going to do is just drive up and touch that foot back down. Oi. Switch 
show up your legs and again, some on the other side. So the second set of strength work we're going to do, put your hands down on the floor, try and touch your wrists with your kneecaps, and if you imagine your toes are like a pivot, all we're going to try and do is just drive your hips nice and high. So as you're getting the backs of your legs and your backside as well, 10 of these, again nice and quick with these. Okay, all right. Those are the two sets you're going to work with, the cardio set initially, and then those two, two exercises of strength work. Do as many sets of those two as you can. Like I said, if you manage two rounds to start with, try three the next time, four after that, five after that, and just keep going. Do uh, email and tweet me how you get on, I'd love to find out, um, and keep an eye out for more videos. Okay.